Uh, really, the big weather story today is more of the windy weather across the majority of the state, but also more of that heightened fire danger. The good news is it's still going to be breezy for Wednesday, just not kind of gusty is what we are seeing right now. And then we are going to be tracking that chance for some showers and storms as early as Friday and then also kind of going into the upcoming weekend. Here's a live look outside at Farmington, San Juan County, looking beautiful on this Tuesday afternoon with nothing but sunshine. Temperatures already climbing into the upper 60s. Look at the relative humidity, though, down to about 10%. We do have that dry wind still moving in out of the west, but already gusting up to about 35 miles per hour. In fact, Farmington under a wind advisory until about 8 o'clock this evening for those sustained winds out of the west around 25 to even 35 miles per hour with some of those higher wind gusts. Now, we are getting a clear scan on the satellite and radar, so really not tracking any clouds and we're not tracking any rain or thunderstorm activity. A little bit of a different story out toward the Midwest. This is actually the same line that brought a lot of severe weather across parts of Kansas and Oklahoma yesterday afternoon, also into the evening hours where they had uh, several long track tornadoes across the Oklahoma area. This is now pushing into parts of uh, central Ohio, non severe storms at this hour. However, it looks like that severe threat will be ramping up over the next several hours and into the evening hours, especially across uh, Illinois, Indiana, and then also down to the south in parts of uh, Kentucky and Ohio. So expecting more tornado watches to get issued as we go into the afternoon. Now we had that same cold front slip through here yesterday. It brought us a little bit of that cooler air right this morning. I'm sure you stepped outside. It was a little cooler. You needed a thicker jacket. We bottomed out at 41 here at the Sunport, already working our way into the upper 60s right now. Nice and comfy with that low relative humidity. We're in the low 70s in Socorro, TRC, Ruidoso at 70, Roswell already working your way into the low 80s, Carlsbad and Hobbs in the mid 80s, Las Vegas, we're at 67, 64 degrees in Gallup, and Silver City back in the low 70s. But this is really the main weather story today with these winds already gusting, especially along those eastern slopes of the Sangre de Cristo. Mountains up to about 40 miles per hour. In fact, Raton, you are seeing those winds gusting upwards of 50 to even 51 miles per hour. So that's why we do have that high wind warning in effect for this area shaded in red until 8 o'clock this evening. This is where we could see some of those higher wind gusts up to about 65 miles per hour. Elsewhere in the yellow, that's where we have a wind advisory until 8 o'clock. Still gusty, but not quite as windy. And we'll see some of those winds gusting up to about 50 to even 55 miles per hour. So for today, we're still so looking at plentiful sunshine across the entire state. It'll be warm here in the metro. We're back into the upper 70s, so closer to normal for this time of year. The heat will be building in across southeastern portions of the state. Highs back are in the lower 90s. We stay windy today, and that will lead to more of that high fire danger. So as we go into Wednesday and Thursday, less wind. We're still dry. However, we will start to see some moisture kind of backing into the area from the east, and that means increasing rain and storm chances Friday and then also as we go into the upcoming weekend. Here's the heat we're talking about. Low 90s for you in Roswell today. Carlsbad, you're at 91. Hobbs at 88. Windy, sunny, dry. Breezy tomorrow with a high of 89, and then notice how temperatures cool back into the 70s. Friday, Saturday with an increased chance for some showers and storms. TRC, we're at 85 this afternoon with uh, windy conditions could see more of that blowing dust along I-10 from Lordsburg to Deming. Window Rock at 68 this afternoon, 71 and windy in Farmington. Breezy tomorrow, but cooler with a high of 61. And then we will kick up those rain chances fr beginning Friday to about 30%. Chama much cooler today with a high of 59. Taos at 66. Santa Fe at 75. Windy conditions today. Breezy tomorrow. Highs are in the upper 60s through Thursday and then notice by Saturday we're calling for about a 50% chance for scattered showers and storms. Roy were windy this afternoon with a high of 75 East Mountains upper 60s to low 70s. Moriarty Estancia topping out near 75 and across the metro we have highs near 82 in Berlin, Los Lunas at 81, 79 in Bernalillo and Corrales. Rio Rancho we are coming in at 79 degrees. Windy today, breezy tomorrow. Notice how temperatures will be a little bit cooler in those lower 70s and we'll kick up those rain chances in the scattered category Friday, Saturday and Sunday, even right here in the Duke City with temperatures a bit cooler in the lower to middle 70s.